Hi, in this video, I will guide you how to install IntelliJ IDEA Community Edition version 2020 with OpenJDK 14 to get started with Java development on Windows operating system. So, what is IntelliJ IDEA? You know, IntelliJ IDEA is an intelligent Java IDE developed by ZBrains company. It is smarter and more powerful than Eclipse and NetBeans and is uh, beloved by many programmers. IntelliJ IDEA is uh, one of the most uh, popular Java IDEs. IntelliJ IDEA comes with two editions. The first one is IntelliJ IDEA Community, which is free and open source for developing uh, Java desktop and Android application. And the second edition is IntelliJ IDEA Ultimate, is a commercial edition for developing Java a web and Java Enterprise application and Java frameworks. And in this video, I will guide you how to download and install IntelliJ IDEA community version, which is free and open source. Suppose that you have a fast computer without any Java programs installed. So you need to download an installer for Windows and you don't need to install Java development kit separately because IntelliJ IDEA is bundled with the uh, runtime environment JRE and uh, you can download and install JDK right inside the IDE and after installation I will guide you how to create your first Java project in uh, IntelliJ IDEA now let's download installer program for IntelliJ IDEA on Windows Open a Chrome browser and head to the download page of IntelliJ IDEA. Go to zprints.com slash idea slash download. And this is a home page of IntelliJ IDEA. Download. And you can see there are two editions uh, of IntelliJ IDEA um, Ultimate and Community. And for beginner in Java programming, uh, I recommend you to use the community version which is free so click the download button to download uh, an installer program for Windows here the file is being downloaded and you see it is quite big over 500 megabytes Okay, the download has completed and uh, click the downloaded file to launch uh, IntelliJ IDEA installer program. And here you see the IntelliJ IDEA community edition setup program. Click next and uh, Next to uh, use the default directory and destination folder for IntelliJ IDEA Community Edition. Next, and here some uh, options for installation. Um, you can choose to create desktop shortcut for 64 bit launcher, uh, create association for .java file. I just choose to create a desktop shortcut and click next install so we are installing the latest version of IntelliJ IDEA as of June 2020 um, IntelliJ IDEA Community Edition version 2020.1 IntelliJ IDEA is heavier than Eclipse uh, and admin so the installation uh, will be uh, longer ok setup has finished completing IntelliJ IDEA community edition setup and check this option to run IntelliJ IDEA community edition Finish. When this dialog appears, import IntelliJ IDEA setting. That just to do not import settings. Okay. And you can see this is a splash screen of IntelliJ IDEA. And just 
click the button uh, skip uh, remaining and set default and uh, IntelliJ IDEA is uh, running you see and uh, you can see this is a welcome dialog of IntelliJ IDEA uh, in which we can create new project or open or import existing project so I create a new project here and you can see because you know, uh, we have installed IntelliJ IDEA without any java development kit installed before so it says that uh, no SDK and uh, with the latest version of IntelliJ IDEA we can download and install the DK right inside the IDE as you can see in the project SDK here we can click uh, the link to download JDK and uh, IntelliJ IDEA uh, recommends uh, to uh, download and uh, install OpenJDK. The latest version is uh, 14 by by one here, and the location to install OpenJDK here. Click download. It is downloading OpenJDK uh, latest version as of June 2020. OpenJDK 14 for Java SE 14 and you can see IntelliJ Community Edition support developing Java desktop, Java FX, Android application with uh, build to suggest Maven, Wordle, Groovy and also developing a colon application as you can see in the left menu here ok so you can see OpenJDK has uh, been installed OpenJDK here and click next and uh, choose this option to create project from template for a command line app next and uh, enter the project name as uh, my first java app base package is um, com.company by default finish and you see IntelliJ idea is creating our first java project this is the tip of the day dialog close and you can see here yeah. in the project view we have the project my first java app here with short directory package name here the main class uh, external libraries is openjdk14 and this is a code for our uh, java class and let's try uh, a statement to bring hello world to the console System.out.greenlight Hello world Java in IntelliJ idea idea 2020 that's it and with IntelliJ idea you don't have to press save button uh, as the IDE, we automatically um, save the changes whenever you type. Okay, now let's run this uh, first Java program. If you can see the play button in green here, you can click here to run this um, class run main. And you can see in the console output, it prints uh, Hello World Java in IntelliJ IDEA 2020 perfectly. And you can see the JDK version used to run our Java application is OpenJDK version 14 here. Awesome, right? 
So far, you have learned how to download and install IntelliJ IDEA Community Edition version 2020 with OpenJDK 14 to get started with Java development on Windows operating system. I hope you will find this video helpful. Please subscribe, like, comment, and share this video. Thank you.